Okay, so here's the deal. Since, well, I flipped my first house in 2009. And in 2013, I decided to be a real estate investor. So I've been buying houses for three years and I love it. But, and some of you might remember this. Uh, some of you may not know this and some of you have tried to forget this. But when I started buying houses, I was nervous and I was scared, especially because I was talking about owner financing and lease options and it was kind of weird and it was uncomfortable and it wasn't what everybody was expecting. But I had this little trick and I did this thing to help motivate myself and to prove to the world that I buy houses and I recommend this to my students and they all think I'm crazy, but I'm gonna try to dig up some old pictures where I'm actually doing this thing. And um, mom, my mom, Kathy, hated it. And Jason basically wanted to crawl under the table every time I did this, but um, I have it right here. This is my button. And I would wear my button on everything because, uh oh, you can't hear me? I had my button and I would wear it on everything. And it says, I buy houses. And this button, I don't know, can you hear me better now? I don't know what kind of magical powers this little I buy houses button has, but I walked into the credit union one day just to make a deposit or get some money or I don't remember what I was doing, but I walked into the credit union and I had my button on. You can't hear me? Sherry, you can't hear me. Can everybody else hear me? Turn your volume up. <laughs> I've got mine on. Okay, so I had this button on when I walked into the credit union, my little I buy houses button, and I'm talking to the teller, and I, I didn't even say anything about buying houses, but she said, what kind of houses do you buy? And I said, I buy pretty houses, I buy ugly houses, I'll, I'll buy houses that have a mortgage, I'll buy free and clear houses, you know, I just, I buy houses, and I didn't have to bring that up, I had my button on. She knew I bought houses because I had my button on. And you can't hardly see it on this dress, but I, I swear I could walk anywhere. I would walk through the grocery store and I'd have this little button on and I'd just be looking at the groceries and people would come up to me and they'd be like, hey, I have a house. So would you come look at it? And y'all, the day that I walked into the credit union with my button on, I made an appointment that afternoon that said, I'm coming out to your house. I went out to her house. I wrote her an offer that day because I had my button on that said, I buy houses. I'd be walking through the grocery store and people would stop me. Really, people would stop me and they'd be like, I have this house that I need somebody to come by. And I would leave the grocery store with an appointment to go look at this person's house. Okay? And I didn't have to bring it up. And I don't know, Scott's on here right now. He's a an officer of the law, a police officer, and they wear badges. And when people see that badge, they know this is somebody that can help me. This is somebody that I need to be on my best behavior in front of. But wearing that badge, and I don't know if it's the same for Scott or the other officers or fire people or other people, but when I put this badge on, I it just took over. Okay, it gave me that confidence that I needed that said, I buy houses. This little $3 button, look, this isn't even the one I wore. This one has a pin on the back. I had one made that was a magnet, so I didn't have to put a hole through my shirt or my dress or whatever I was wearing or my jacket. And people would just walk up to me and say, hey, I have a house. Will you come look at it? And I would set so many appointments from this button all off market or people with agents would come up and they're like hey my agent isn't doing a good job will you come look at my house nope sorry don't deal with it if you got it listed with an agent i'm not interested in it i'm 
I don't even know. Where, I don't even want to know where it is. Don't tell me about it. <laughs> okay. I'm still there. And so maybe you're on this journey of real estate investing, and you don't want to go out and get a bunch of t-shirts made like I have, you know, I've got shirts now that says Whitney buys houses. So it's the same reaction. But when I would wear this button that said I buy houses, people would talk to me. Okay. Victoria's on now. She has shirts. She has a button that says I buy houses and it works. I watched Jay Connor the other day do a video and he was doing a video and he was talking about some drink that he drinks every morning, but his shirt said, I buy houses. It was nice. It was embroidered. It said, I buy houses. And so I'm watching this video. I'm listening to him talk about this juice that he drinks every morning. But all I see is that he buys houses. So if you're a new, if you're a new investor, if you're wanting to get into investing and you want to dabble in it, you want to test the water. You want to stick one little foot in and see if this kind of works. I tell all my ladies to go to Office Max or Office Depot or a button shop, wherever you want to go. And I would highly suggest getting the magnet back instead of this because you can put that magnet on a coat, you can put it on a pretty shirt, you can put it on a pretty dress, but exactly like what Lanise just said, it's not very subliminal. Okay, this is a bright yellow button. It didn't match anything that I wore, but it stood out. I could wear it with anything and it would pop and people would be like, oh, she buys houses. You don't know the deals I got. I got out of the house one time. I'm driving around. I'm driving for dollars. I'm looking for deals. And I saw a for sale by owner sign. It was summertime. There was somebody out mowing. I get out of the car. Honest to goodness, I get out of the car. I go wave this guy down. I've got my button on. I wave this guy down and I'm like, hey, so you're trying to sell this house? And he's like, yeah. And you buy houses. And I was like, yeah, hey, my name's Whitney. I mean, before I can even introduce myself, he knows that I buy houses. I ended up writing a contract that day. We went inside, looked at the house. I followed him to his house where his wife was, and we signed a contract that day. And he told me when I was leaving, he said, you know, I've been praying for somebody that would want to buy this house and then here you come, you bebop out of your car and you got on this button that says you buy houses. Like, I was praying for somebody who buys houses to come talk to me. And here you are with this little cheesy button that says I buy houses. So, that's my uh, PSA of the day. Um, and I don't care you know, if you're in Mary Kay, Mary Kay ladies wear a badge that says Mary Kay and their name. Okay? So if you're thinking about Mary Kay and then you walk by a lady in the grocery store and she's got on her Mary Kay badge, you can say, oh my gosh, I was just thinking that I needed somebody with Mary Kay. Do you have this, that, and the other in your car? I've done that. The um, It Works people. I was out on a field trip with one of the uh, boys with Gavin last year and I had uh, run out of the, um, not the wraps, but they've got some like herbal enhancement stuff that I like to take. It gives me more energy. Can you imagine I need more energy? But anyway, this woman had on an It Works shirt. Duh. She's got the stuff that I need and I could buy a bottle right then. All right. So if you want to buy houses, if you want to get into this, and real estate agents wear it, okay? I was at a golf tournament a couple weeks ago, and I'm speaking to this lady, and she's got on a badge that said, uh, I don't remember what it said, uh, realty executives. Oh, so you're a real estate agent. I mean, boom. Okay? So, I know it's nice, and you think that just because you told everybody on Facebook once that you buy houses, that everybody suddenly knows that you buy houses, but don't forget about the people that are out just walking around that need to know that you buy houses. And if you're, you know, a loud mouth talkie like I am, <laughs> and you've got this button on in the grocery store or at the uh, credit union or at the movies, I mean, I'm telling y'all, I wore this thing everywhere. I wore it out to restaurants. I would put it on in the morning. I would wear it all day, no matter where I went. And people would talk to me because I buy houses. I don't wear this anymore because I got the shirts that says Whitney buys houses. Um, 
and it's just as effective. I was at Cracker Barrel last Wednesday or Thursday and I had on a pink Whitney Buys Houses and the guy behind me, you know, I'm talking, flirting with the um, hostess and the guy behind me said, did I hear you on the radio? <laughs> I said, yes, you did. <laughs> okay, so when you have on that sign, he could hear me, he recognized my voice, but he also knew that I was Whitney with Whitney Buys Houses and my shirt says Whitney Buys Houses. You put bandit signs out that say Whitney Buys Houses. People will call and say, hey, I saw your sign. Duh, it works, okay? So if you want to start buying houses, go get you one of these little guys, okay? If you go to a boot camp, like the first boot camp I went to, they gave us these big honking, ugly orange I Buy Houses buttons. I have those around here somewhere too. They work. When you buy enough that you can go and you can get it embroidered in your shirts, like I've got a lot of cardigans or nice shirts now and it's embroidered when he buys houses, but it's because this stuff works. Go get you a button. I think this is like three bucks before you get everything monogrammed or um, stitched, whatever that's called. Go get you a button and try the button, okay? Put an I Buy Houses button on, wear it everywhere, from the time you leave your house to the time you get home at night, and tell me if it doesn't boost your confidence, and tell me if it doesn't bring in some weird leads that you would have never found out about otherwise. Because this thing works. Um, and while I got you here, I'm gonna tell you that we're gonna get started on this September class. My ladies that started in August, uh, one of them was working on a duplex deal three days after she started the class. Uh, another one is working on a vacation rental up in Gatlinburg now, 17 days after she started the class. So if you're ready to get started in real estate investing, go to allaboutrei.com, allaboutrei.com, fill out my application and book a call. And I will tell you, you're not gonna like this, but I'm only teaching ladies. I like working with women. I have a passion to work with women and I speak woman, okay? Men ask questions that I know the answer to, but that women, we just don't care about. We just wanna get the deal done. And I teach women how to build a cash flowing real estate portfolio, okay? So if you wanna talk about real estate, that's all I can talk about. I've lost the ability to talk about anything else. But, and if you are one of my ladies, go get an I Buy Houses button. Thanks, Brenda. Go get an I Buy Houses button and tell me if the deals don't start just flowing to you. All right, y'all have a great day. Happy investing. I have an interview with Realtor.com here in a couple minutes, so I've got to go and drink some more coffee so that my energy is up, but let me know. Go to allaboutrei.com and fill out the application if you wanna get started in the September group, and I will start blasting up your news feed with that here in a couple days. So thanks, happy investing, I'll talk to y'all later.